Hello guys and welcome back to CC Fragrances today from the sunny and beautiful Munich and it's a superstar battle between Aqua Di Gio Profumo versus Yves Saint Laurent Y EDP. But before we start, check out our Instagram and TikTok page for more informative and entertaining content about different fragrances and now we will present you the ingredients and after that we ask the girls, let's go guys! Let's start off with Isolero Y EDP with a fresh opening with the bergamot and the sweet green apple. In the mid we have the unique sage note and in the base there's a lot of sweet tonka bean. Great fragrance. Let's continue with Aqua di Gio Profumo, the most famous designer fragrance on this planet. And already the name tells us that it's a really fresh and aquatic fragrance with the bergamot. In the mid we have the seductive incense and in the base there's the masculine patchouli. And now we will ask the girls which one they prefer today. Let's go. First one and the second one to different fragrances. Can we switch? Yes, of course. The A one, okay. So one point for Aqua di Gio, two points for Aqua di Gio Profumo. And from one to 10, how many points would you give the fragrance you prefer if 10 is the best? So for the A. Eight. Yeah. Okay. Great Same. rating. Thank you very much. Okay. And the second one. This one. This one. Yes. The B. So if Saint Laurent Y gets one point, and from one to ten, how many points would you give this one? If ten is the best. Eight. Eight. Great rating. Thank you very much. Could we use this for YouTube? Would it be okay for you? Yeah, it's okay. Great. It's okay. First one and the second one. A or B? I think this one. This one, B. So Yves Saint Laurent Y gets one point and from one to ten, how many points would you give this one if ten is the best? Uh, seven. Seven, okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> Both are good. Which one would, would you prefer for man? A or B? Yeah, I would prefer this. Yes, me too. The B. Yes. Okay, so two points for Yves Saint Laurent Y and from 1 to 10, how many points would you give the B if 10 is the best? 8. 8, okay, and yes, you? Yes, yes, 8. 8 too, <laughs> great ratings, thank you very much. I think this one. I think this one. Sorry? Yeah, yeah. A or B, difficult. B. Yeah. Okay. A. So two points for Yves Saint Laurent Y and one point for Aqua di Gio Profumo. And from one to ten, how many points would you give the fragrance you prefer? So you two B and you A if ten is the best. I think nine. Yeah, me too. Nine. Nine. Okay. And you? Nine point five. Okay. Great Ooh. ratings. Thank you very much. <laughs> the second one. This one, the yep. B. So if Saint Laurent Y gets one point, and you, which one would you prefer? No. Okay. So from one to ten, how many points would you give the B? Yeah, yeah. Ten is the eight. best. Eight. Okay. Great rating. Thank you very much. So we have to change. switch. Yes. I like this one more. The A. Okay. Yes. Which one would you prefer? This is like super. I don't know. Sweet. Strong, okay, stronger. The A2, so two points for Aqua di Gio Profumo, and from one to ten, how many points would you give this one if ten is the best? Six. Six, okay, yeah, not maybe so like good. Seven. Seven, yeah. okay, thank you very much. A or B? Okay. <laughs> okay, this one is good. This one is good, Okay. This one. You prefer A. Yeah. Okay, Aqua di Gio is get, getting one point. And what would you say? Something on that one. I think this is better. You think B is better? Yeah. Okay, Yves Saint Laurent. And from one to ten, how many points would you give your fragrance that you have chosen? Nine to eight. Nine to eight, yeah, okay. Same, nine eight to eight. Eight. Okay, thank you very much. Can we use it for YouTube? Would it be okay? Mm -hmm. A card for you that you can watch yeah. it? CC Fragrances is our name. 
we are from Germany. A or B? Two different ones. Which one would be better on a man? You say B. Okay, yeah. Issa Laura is getting two points and from one to ten, how many points would you give it as a rating? Eight points. Seven. Okay, Seven. great ratings. Can we use it for YouTube? CC Fragrances is our name, a card for you that you can watch it. Yeah. Would it be okay? Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Have yeah. a great day. Bye. Bye. A or B? Two different ones. For me, B. B is better. Okay, yeah. Yves Solora is getting one point, and from one to ten, how many points would you give it as a rating for B? Uh, I would say nine. Nine points, really great rating. Much. Okay, thank you very much. Can we use it for YouTube? CC Fragrances is our name, a card for you ah. that you can watch it. Okay. Yeah, thank you, so thank much. you very much. Have thank a great you. day. Bye. I, I did uh, fragrance. A or B? Which one you prefer? I prefer A. You prefer A. Okay, Aqua DG Profumo. And you? A or B? Okay, and from 1 to 10, how many points would you give it as a rating? I would give it 8. 8. And you? Just the rating? 6 maybe. Okay, okay. <laughs> thank you very much. CC Fragrance is our name, a yeah. card for you. Thank, thank you. you very much. Have, Have a great day. day. You're okay. A or B? Um, probably B. B. Okay, Yves yeah. Laura is getting one point, and from okay. one to ten, how many points would you give it as a rating? Um, like a seven. Seven. Okay. Yeah. A or B? Okay. So I can say like you guys. B. You say B. Yves Laura Y gets two points, and from one to ten, how many points would you give it as a rating? Uh, seven. Seven. Okay. Nine. Nine, great point. So guys, this was our amazing battle today in Munich and in the end, Yves Saint Laurent Y EDP has beaten the designer superstar. And now we hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to check out our Instagram and TikTok page, like, subscribe and turn on notifications that you don't miss any videos of us. See you the next time to CC Fragrances. Bye.